Hey guys, Onyx here. Today I'm going to bring you some news for December. That's right, some news that has come in December and after December. Um, I was at a eSports stream last night. I've been going to them quite frequently now. Um, we're really enjoying them and I'd like to help out if I can. And um, there's uh, Jack Felling and Pez Radar and a couple of the other TC crew was in there answering a couple of questions. So I asked a couple and kept an eye on the chat and there's a couple of things that I noticed. First off, Okay, so this is one of the screenshots that I took last night, and it is one of the one thing that Jack fell in reply to someone, with, and she said, Yes, yeah, sometimes they come along like Roma Jewels, also upcoming team weapon skins will be like that. So what she was actually what she was actually meaning was there's going to be future airdrops with team weapon skins, so maybe like an optic gaming uh drop or something like that, which I have the full set. Thank the Lord. Also, last night I got to ask Pets Radar. I, well, I asked him uh, if there's any chance of a teaser for the two new maps coming in December, and I gave him a little wink to see what he replied with. And he actually replied to me, and I think you guys are going to be interested in December's map picks because he said that the two maps in December are uh, basically one is going to be a remastered and one is going to be a new, new map, like a new map that they have made for the game, which is super awesome. I can't wait to see the new map because I mean I don't want all remastered maps I just want to see maybe a couple more remastered but I want to see some new content that they're making which is freaking awesome and finally also in the news uh, Jack Fallon was talking about uh, what the changes were made to the esports pack and explained what the money actually goes to and why it's a why they're that price mainly because the fact that it costs them money to create custom content and it cost and most of the pack actually goes to support the esports program but they managed to change the uh, in-game pack duplicates which is a good thing but I still believe that they should add a couple of more things to the pack to make it a bit better for example um, a lot of people would like an airdrop instead so a black steel airdrop say £40, £30 and you'd be able to get all of them like all the characters and all the weapon skins but I don't know we'll have to see if you have enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up because it helps me out a lot and subscribe if you're new to the channel for some more news like this and as always peace